Yo, yo, yo! Welcome back to the 5 6 Chamber, Chamber. the only authentic hip hop show in India, as That's always. Right. Jalebi the Kid with me is Dope Boy Ghost. DBG! We got King Sinister in the building. Yes, sir. Pop, pop, goddamn, yes, boy. How you doing, man? How you been, bro? Been good, homie. Been good. Just got, da- got back from Mumbai. Had a gig down G. there. I mean, I, I seen the moves, bro. We know you out here. D&B King, a whole lot of other shit. Yes, sir. Uh, we're going to talk more about that in a second, but let's just get into that rap shit, right? Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Bring it. Right, right, right. 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 Yes, sir. Let's run that beat up. Produced by Ghosty. Ghosty. King Sinister. Uh. Right. Right. Five, six chains. Right, right, right. We probably get it smoking real loud, boy. We probably get it rolling real loud, boy. We probably get it smoking real loud, boy. We gonna get it rolling real loud. Uh. You see yeah. us rolling like a motherfucking king of the okay. town. You see us rolling like we probably rolling six bowls now. You see me fooling up with my G's and never gonna be shutting down. Shutting every party in and out of town. You see me riding round, motherfucker trying to stop me. You ain't never stopping me. I'm riding my RC in 160, boy. Try and stop me, you could probably frisk me, boy. Coppers trying to get up on my mind. They wanna check my license, probably never got it on me Ain't nobody ever telling me how I probably just shut up eat down Probably won the fucking town Motherfuckers looking at me like I'm the king of the town Probably got no crown, got my head looking like crowns Motherfucker like a lion, got the main up and then down And I'm probably smoking rounds, motherfucker shooting rounds You could probably pull up another one, you shooting rounds, right? I probably gonna smoke so loud I'm probably gonna roll real loud. I'm probably gonna smoke so loud. I'm probably gonna real, real loud. Hey, hey. We gonna keep on rolling like nobody ever told us how we taught us how to keep hey, it. Lord. We gonna keep on rolling and we gonna keep on smoking like nobody ever taught us we gonna keep it litty. Ch- ch- I probably did some chunga last night. I probably took the motherfucking life. Damn. I probably saw my life pass by Then what? And then I probably took a sat back What? Sat back, then I relaxed and took another puff of the blunt And then I looked at the stars and then I saw myself shooting away Look like at me shooting away I probably looking at a light, yeah, going by, pass by Motherfucker last night, you could probably see me sip on Hennessy and pass by Pass by, got my G's telling me I can't ride Ride up on any beat, you could never kill me, that's right, that's, that's right, right. You know I probably kill the beat like you be seeing me I probably do this every single night, right? Drum and bass or hip hop, I probably the king of the town You can probably see me shining wild, right? right. You ain't never seen nobody do this shit like we be doing every single Friday That's right. We probably do this shit like every single Friday Like every single day like it was Monday Back on a motherfucking beat we probably ride out Back on a motherfucking stack we probably shine now Back on a motherfucking beat we probably ride out Back on a motherfucking stack we probably shine now shine Yo, now. yo, yo, King G-G. Sinister G-G. in the building d and B King of the City yes, Produced sir. by Dope Boy Ghost when yeah, he was high know. on something Y'all Shout know what it is Dope Boy Ghost, my man This drum and bass beat it's probably one of the best drum and beats. I see, but bass. you gotta put me in the lineup. Bro. Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely. Yeah, you yeah, say yeah, it yeah, on young, young, young wall, young wall, bro. Out here, we get to that in a second, bro. <laughs> but listen, man, I got a couple things I want to ask you about, bro. Yes, sir. Yo, first off, just like, what's good? What you working on? When them DMB tracks you got dropping? What's in the vault, bro? I got a lot of DNB, and it's not just DNB. I got a lot of dubstep also coming up, and uh, I've been working on this one particular track. Which is uh, a rendition of Gabbar. Oh, yeah? From Shaolay. That's sick, bro. Yeah. Um, so I play the character of Gabbar. And I'm bringing the Southside flavor. Like, y'all know I rep Southside to my death. I mean, that, there's no so doubt. Sorry. Yes, sir. Looking forward to that, man. I, that. I wanted to say, though, I liked, uh, I liked that Roots track you made, right? Yes, sir. Because you was taking yes, that sir. back. To, like, I mean, because, you know... Your flow crazy. You yeah. always had that, especially with this DMB hosting, you know, you just bless, whoop, bless, you bless, a whip, right? Bless. But coming back to them bars that, like, you know, I'm, I, so I'm so happy to see you doing both of those, bro. Yes, sir. But, you know, 
we old friends, we go way back. I wanted to shoot a couple of things with you, talk some shit, right? Yeah, definitely. Talk Let's your go. shit. <laughs> Yo, so I'm you know, just going to hit you real quick, quite bro. You know, hip hop booming out here. A lot of artists trying to do what they got to do to get ahead. Some of them, you know, they doing things that are questionable. So I want to ask you this, bro, because you've been in the game for a second. How you feel when rappers do shit like, you know, when they go out and they buy bots and shit, bro, and try to act like they grew organically? Like, is that hip hop to you or what? No, that ain't real shit to me. Forget about it being hip hop. That ain't real at all. I mean, I feel that, bro. But like, I'm just like, do you do you think the Indian scene like? I feel like, how, how do we let people get away with that th kind of thing here? You know what I'm saying? Like, isn't it our job as rappers? We Like, should we be calling those people out or just let it slide? What do you think? In this age and world that we're living in, whatever goes on the internet or how you get yourself on the internet, nobody gives a fuck about it. It's not legal. It's not illegal how you get it. I mean, that's facts, bro. I can't argue with that. And at the end of the fucking day, if you see uh, people look for and go for artists who've got better numbers irrespective of how they've gotten it. Right. Yeah. I mean, see, what I think about this, like, people that do this right now is 2023, right? This shit, have, this shit would have worked in, like, 2020. And half of the people that have, like, 100,000, 200,000 followers or they're, like, it's all bots. I mean, right? I, guess, I guess what I would just say, my feeling on it... It's not necessarily all bots. Not all well, of them, yeah. but mostly, like, the people yeah, that... Yeah. I get, I guess, what, I get bro, what you're like, saying, If yeah. people are not showing up at your shows, if you don't got monthly listeners that match the bots you have, yeah, yeah, then yeah. it's bots, bro. Yeah, fair enough, yeah. Like, you know what I'm I get, saying? I get what you're saying, yeah. All the hard work that we all, we all work on our own stuff, we put in hard work. Yes, sir. But I wouldn't spend my money on a, on something that's not real because, like, I want people to listen to my music. And if yeah. no one listens to my music, I'll listen to my music. Yeah, fair you know, enough, yeah. I, I, I want to just add on that, bro. One of the things I always respect about you, man, is that, like, you know, you got a problem, you feel some type of way, you happy, whatever, it's out. I know, you know. I've, had, I've got a couple phone calls over the years from you where you're like, Carter, what the fuck? Yeah. Right? <laughs> yeah. Um, I guess all I'd say, man, it's just like, I feel like if you buy in bots, don't pretend like you not buy in bots, bro. If someone ghostwriting your lyrics, don't pretend like someone not ghostwriting your lyrics, yeah. right? Yeah, agree. Be yeah. where you at in this game, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, there, there are a lot of fucking big artists that have... A bunch of ghostwriters. Some of your biggest shows that are happening have asked some of us to ghostwrite for them. But the thing some is, in like every of, every other happening. genre, it's okay, bro. Beyonce, Rihanna, they all got ghostwriters. But when it comes to hip hop and rap, it gotta come from the fucking artists, cause like they telling their story. Any yeah, other genre, it don't agreed. matter. Agreed, agreed. But we are in the in the industry of entertainment, and it's not just That's, one yeah. thing that brings out one artist. It's a whole package of everything put together. It's that finesse product that they all look for. I feel that, G. And you know what I mean? We've been, we've, been, we've been seeing the growth for a while, you know? I know you got that stage presence, all that. Um, got a couple more questions before we get into that next beat, you know what I'm saying? But just a Bangalore scene, bro. Who you fucking with? Who you think is underrated? Who you think is overrated? Who you think is up next? You know? Where you think we at? The Bangalore scene is Bangalore scene on a general on the whole is very under fucking rated compared to all of your cities that are putting out there. Facts. Oh uh, shit and Facts. all of that stuff. But the fact is artists in Bangalore are vastly diverse and can spit in languages that you probably won't even think of learning. Yeah, bro. And that's the that's the beauty of this fucking city. And the sad part of, about it is everybody who's grown up, who's hit the bigger markets from the city, have all done it on their own. They've either had a team of guys who were with them always to help them push them, or they've had somebody investing in them. And that's the sad part about here. But if you go to places like Chennai, you go to places like Mumbai, you go to places like Pune, you go to places like Delhi, you have... Um, you have established um, centers that, and established uh, established people that who help you, who can give you what you basically need. I'd actually, I would say that the place in Bangalore <laughs> where you have that is in the Kannada scene. Yeah, yeah, right. Agreed. Those agreed. boys, you agreed. know, we had Biju on this show, right? Yeah, yeah. And you know, he came through to help out. As much as it as much as it was something for him, like it's he's helping us out with that, right? He believe in our vision. Yeah. He it, it, is it for him exclusively? No, you know. Yeah, yeah. 
You know, there's some other big rappers. I'm not going to name their name right now, but I'll tell you there are rappers who are as big as Biju, whose man, who wouldn't even talk, you know, who, whose manager is like, oh, bro, sorry, we can't make it. Yeah. And just acted like this doesn't matter to them at all. And those people, again, I ain't going to name no names, but those people, if they came through here, it would be so good for everybody, right? You know, or not even not even necessarily this show, but just in general, like yeah, in general. these boys need to put up other people on, right? That's what, that's what I think you're trying to say. If you saw the BET Awards that happened, Busta says, get down with the beef, yo. We all need that money. We all need that bag. We all got to go get that bag. Exactly, you know. You and if saying? you have beef with the, if you have beef with me and you watching this, feel free to give me a call. Happy to talk anytime. Yeah, if anybody has got beef, hit me up. I'll set y'all with a boxing match. <laughs> <laughs> y'all down for that? Y'all can get get your beef sorted, yo. <laughs> Damn, bro. Yeah, man. If you can't rap battle, we can scrap. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exact fucking league. But you know, uh, anyways. We should be settling things in rap. And speaking of, we got one more beat for you. Yes, sir. Bring it to um, this, is, uh, this is that old school shit. Like I told you, uh, yes, the sir. only guy who was ever featured on Nas's <laughs> first album, AZ. Yeah. Uh, got got, got a beat of his for you. Yes, so uh, let's run that up. You ready? Yeah. Let's go. All right. Three. Right. Hey. Go. I'm from the KL down south, Indian and dark brown Bending all they loving us, they say my head fit like a crown My chest ready to get down, I will look all and it's a crowd Might sound arrogant and loud, but you see us shooting some rounds Pocket keep out, we doing no loud, and never know how to take it all How much your mama sick it's all about, and what the mama sick it's all about How much you probably won't ever die down Uh, 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 uh I probably sit back and relax on the beat now Let me get into the zone, motherfucking heat now I probably spit in the microphone, bring the heat down Probably bring the place down, motherfucker ace now, ace now They call me the ace of the town We probably look like a motherfucking G from where we sound Bring the sound from the south side, motherfucking weapon nights Probably got a seven, put it in your face and let it fly Let, let it fly. fly, got that sword swinging left to right Motherfucker, you could probably swing and punch it left and right I probably step into the ring and beat you down Beat you down, you probably count it out One, two, three, now We probably switch and fly you probably look at motherfuckers in the fucking eye. eye You probably wanna look at me, they so fire in the red Motherfucker, you be sorry to see me red I probably never gonna get dead, I probably get dead plus You could probably see me, I'm end up getting dressed I probably look at y'all, I probably get my test finessed yeah. Probably get my test finessed I probably get my test finesse. Motherfuckers telling me to get my blessed in this. I probably, probably gonna, gonna get blessed. I probably look at the sky and I'm gonna be blessed. Let got my cook. homies sitting out with me. We probably get it now. Really, none of taking my city. You probably check out with it. We probably do the shit at every single town. Motherfucker, we don't ever give a damn. I'm how we riding. We riding. I'm about fighting. We fighting. We probably getting. You got it. Uh, we probably get it and get it and never denying what we be probably feeling Motherfuckers in the heart to probably dealing and delivering, delivering motherfucking paces Motherfucker, you lace it, you lace it like I was placing Motherfucker, cigarette with that paint, we probably smoking loud Smoke a motherfucker down, motherfucker pack now Pack, come pack, come pack, I probably lost my fucking lungs and back to back And then I still fucking rap like a fucking monster On a motherfucking beat, I'm smoking dokas Motherfucker in a bong, I'm probably choker Make you wanna choke when you probably pull the door Motherfucker, nobody ever see me Probably do this shit like I was riding on a beat I'm probably slipping in like I was smoking on a beat I'm probably chilling in Rock my homies on the beat, we probably living it yeah, yeah, yeah. Living life like it's five times Got nine lives, motherfucker, you call it cock nine Catch me, motherfucker, flying about nights I probably look a motherfucker in the eye Then I get by, get by on the beat Then yes, I get sir. by GG Gang, King gang. Sinister in the motherfucking building. I'm going to take the shades off for a second. Look at the camera. Listen here. That's versatility. You know what I'm saying? Boom bap to DMB. All off top. I do what I can, bro. I know, I know, I, I know, man. I can. <laughs> We're probably going to take it all the way, man. You know what I'm saying? It's, uh, thank you for coming in, bro. God bless. You know, God bless. Fucking thank fire you guys. shit as always. Thank you guys for you having know, me. You uh, know, 
You look Shut good up. with the long hair, man. That shaggy shit. You know, <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm, I'm just calling it on camera. Bringing back doses and drugs. First post gonna be about his hair. Y'all gonna see that. Bet that. I probably hide a bunch of shit in my hair and walk around, you know. Something like that. <laughs> 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 shout out to Carter. Shout out to Dope Boy Ghost, Five Six Chamber in the fucking building. Yo, Yo we in the fucking building. Five Six Chambers coming everywhere from Bangalore to across the fucking world. Street Is City Studios. Audio Craft Studios. Cypher Cypher. Y'all know what it is. Catch us next time. We out here. <laughs>